friends, it is Lee and you are watching Beauty Over 70 with Lee. Good morning, good morning, and welcome to the channel. If you are new, I welcome each of you today and I'm so glad that you stopped by. In today's video, I am going to be doing a review that this company has sent me another product to review. I did not purchase this. I did not have to do a video on this. I did this because I really, really like this particular company and I like this product that I'm about to share with you. It's not a new product. It's been around by iMethod and I have worked with them before. They're a wonderful company to work for. And the representative that I work with, Olivia, is absolutely a jewel. She is a jewel to work with. I have been sick, as most of my subscribers know. And I told her, I said, you know, I've got to put that on the back burner till I'm able to do it. And she said, no worries, no worries, no pressure. Whenever you're ready, you do it. So today's the day I'm going to show you the Eye Method Winged Eyeliner that they sent me. And uh, this little particular product, as well as most of you know, it's a little stamp. It's in black that you stamp the little wing tip so you don't have to freelance that on. And I have become more and more shaking. I have, I am will be 75 years old in June, and I do not have the steady hands that I used to be and used to have. None of us do. So I am going to do my best to, um, to get this particular product on and do my best to give it a good representation. And like I said, um, this is how it's packaged. It's, it's a wing tip liner stamp that I'm going to be trying today. Um, and this is what it looks like. And I love this new packaging. The older one that I have tried, um, it I believe it's black. Don't hold me to that, but I believe it's black. But this particular one they have put in pink. And as you can see, it's the eye method wing tip, but you can see there is a right and a left. And so if you keep those caps accordingly, then you know which one is goes for the right and which one for the left. But if you get them mixed up, then you've got to stamp it to make sure that you don't get it upside down, you know. So um, it does have a left and it has a right. So like I said, if you keep them or you mark them, put you a magic little magic marker and put a... Um, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put a right and a left that's going to be on there permanent. So when I put the cap back on it, I know this particular one is for the right because my little Sharpie is right there with an R. And this one is for the left. And my little L is going to be right there. So it also has a liner. It has a thick liner in it to line. And it also has a finer point on the other end. So that is a little fine micro fine, and that is a plus for this particular product. I like that, and most of the ladies will like that. Here it shows. Um, if you could see how I work down here in my studio, I have a box, and I have a tissue box turned upside down so I can put my little... 10 magnification, 12 up here so I can see, but I'm gonna take my camera lens and I'm gonna zoom in real close when I start so you can hopefully see me this do this correctly. This particular product is smudge proof. It is waterproof. I, I absolutely just got finished doing a get ready with me. And I already have my makeup done. I did a mascara review. So I have my makeup done. I have my mascara on. I have my shadow on. I have everything on except this wingtip liner um, stamp. So we're going to put that on now. Put the, and I'm going to zoom in here close where I can see what I'm doing here. And I'm going to come in real close so you can see actually what I'm doing with my magnification mirror and I hope I can get this straight so let's see how this goes 
I'm going to stamp that and make, see if I can get this. Okay, my friends, um, I'm going to line. I'm going to fill that in with this little micro pen. Like I said, it's double sided. This is the more than of the um, micro, and the other end is um, a little bit more blunt. That's the liner that comes with it. So um, these hands are almost 75 years old. I'm going to finish this, and I'm going to line this on out here a little bit. Try to. Hope you can see what I'm doing here. Bringing that out, point out just a little bit. There we go. Can you see that? I hope you can. And what I'm going to do at this point, shadow brush, and I'm going to put a little bit, fill in a little bit of color along the bottom and um, um, a dark green shadow along the bottom to kind of connect that together. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm going to take that and just dip it in my green eyeshadow and just connect that a little bit over here. There. Just a tad bit more, ladies. And connect it so it doesn't look like it's just kind of floating up there, if you know what I mean. So, there. That's it. It would look better. It would look much better and uh, if I had on my lashes. I just have on, uh, like I said, I just got finished filming a... Let me back this up just a little bit so you can see. Um, I just got finished filming a, um, a tutorial on um, a new mascara that a company had sent me. So I thought, why waste the makeup? Just go with it and um, go ahead and do this um, eye method. So that's what it looks like on these aging eyes. And I want to thank iMethod for reaching out to me again. And like I said, the agent, the representative rather that helps me, Olivia, I want to. She is a doll. She, she is an absolute jewel to work with. And thank you so much, Olivia, for sending me this iMethod Perfect Wings with the two. It has the two... Um, the left and the right in the pink, which is much easier to see than the black. You can see the left and the right. The other was labeled left and right, but this is so much easier to see in the pink. And it does come with the double-sided liner as well. So it has more of a blunt and it has the little micro tip in there as well. So. Thank you, iMethod, for sending me these products. And I, I thank Olivia again for reaching out to me and being so kind to send these for a review. And I didn't have to do a review. I chose to do a review on my YouTube channel. And I also want to go on Amazon and do a review where you can find it. Because anytime I like a product... I am going to give my honest review. And again, it may not work for you, but I think it will, my friends, if you give it a try. It certainly works for me. I use it and I like it. And um, thank you, iMethod, for doing that. And uh, what do I have on today? Goodness, what do I have on today? I have on a pair of earrings, which they're kind of like a greenish, um, metallic look, and it changes color, necklace and earrings that my husband actually purchased for me when we were in Hawaii. So I, I saw these at a little vendor 
when we went to a low owl, they were set up and selling, you know, the jewelry. And I happened to see those and I love them. And he said, you know, they're yours. You, you uh, bag them up for the lady and they're yours. So it's a little necklace and the little earrings. And I put it on with my little ruby road top today. It has a little tie, but I did not tie it. I just put on my jewelry. And I'm going to back the camera up and I'm going to stand up and let you see what I have on. It's a little ruby road top and it's from last year actually. But before I do stand up, I'm going to take my microphone off, my road microphone off because I'm going to have to unhook that. But I'm going to tell you what I have on my lipstick because every time I do a video, you ladies, my friends want to know what kind of lipstick you have on. And today I have on, let me stick my glasses on just a second because I had it down here. And let me grab the, um, okay. You asked me what kind of lipstick I have on, the color and everything. So I'm going to tell you right off the bat. It's a Maybelline and it's called Pink Score. Pink Score is the lipstick that I have on today and it's number 244. Pink Score by Maybelline. And I'll show that to you. It's a gorgeous color for spring. I love Maybelline lipstick. And for the price point, you can't beat them. This is a very moisturizing formula with the little burgundy top. And that is the lipstick that I am wearing today. Uh, camera just a little bit for you to see. But I am going to show you the top I have on. It's a Ruby Road top. And I picked it up last year, I believe. And I'm going to scoot this way out my chair all the way where you can see this. I hope you can see it. And this a little, top's a little low for me. But anyway, there's a little tie here. And you can tie it if you want. But I just chose to put let it hang and put on my jewelry. And it's kind of a turquoise, one of my favorite colors with the, the green banana leaves. And look, the sleeve is like this. It kind of, you know, it's got this kind of a, a draping. And that's what it looks like. It looks like I'm going to fly away. But that is what I have on today. That is my Ruby Road. I picked it up last year. And I, when it gets super, super hot, this is fantastic. Throw it on with a pair of leggings. Uh, tennis shoes and blue jeans under here, my friends. <laughs> and that's the... That is the thrill when you get ready to do a video. Here up, you can just put on whatever you want to put on and you're good to go. Anyway, that's what I had on today. And I, I always get questions what I have on, so I wanted to show that to you. Yep, the hair's still growing. I don't know if I'm going to end up with a bob or not, but it's still growing. And my manicure, and that feels so much better feels so good to get a manicure and a pedicure, and that was so relaxing, and I did so enjoy it. I method. I want to thank you for watching, and if you like the content, I invite you to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. Leave me a comment, please. Um, as you know, I'm diligently trying to reach my 1,000 subscribers that YouTube requires, and I can't. I have the best subscribers. I have the best subscribers that any content creator, YouTube, Uber, whatever you want to call us, but our technical name is a content creator. I have the best subscribers, and I thank you from the bottom of my big heart for subscribing, for sticking with me, and we're rocking on another year now, so wait for that video. It's going to be upcoming, I promise. Thank you again. I'm going to hope you have a fantastic week. It's springtime. Get out and enjoy it and be thankful for your blessings. I know I am every single day. Today, better than yesterday. And remember that I love you. See you next Thursday. Bye-bye, my friends.